How does it feel watching that back? Because you're all really laughing there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we've, just, we've listened to it so many times, we've rehearsed it so many times that we sometimes, you know, every now and again we, we pick out imperfect, like if there's the slightest thing. But, you know, it, we, we just love watching it and it's just fantastic to watch. But um, oh, you were just can't believe we did it. Brilliant. You were absolutely brilliant. Did you think you were going to win? I mean, how was it when they announced you're the winners? It was absolutely incredible. I mean, we didn't, you didn't we never think you're going to win. Um, the fact that it was such a talent competition in the final, like any, it was anybody's, anybody could have won it, but obviously we were really happy that it was us. Yeah, and Jamie, I could see by the look on your face that you in particular were, were hit by the news, weren't you? I, I think, you know, it's such, a, it's such a stressful situation to be in because you, the, your whole life depends on it. And we were really aiming for top three, weren't we? And then suddenly we found ourselves in the top two with Lucy Kate, who is, you know, just phenomenal. She really pulled it out of the bag on Saturday. And for us to have won such a fantastic final, I mean, the news, yeah, I mean, I was flawed, <laughs> completely flawed. <laughs> and what happens from now? Because we were just talking about there, your day jobs, labourers, whether it's, you know, working in a restaurant. Have you all handed your notice in? Is that it? I mean, last week I actually went back to work. Um, I'm at the petrol station, yeah. Um, and everyone there is so supportive. I mean, they know that this is what I want to do. And so handing my notice in, maybe, hopefully, <laughs> I think. But um, they're, they're all completely behind us. I'm actually still working there. <laughs> um, they've asked for my dates for June and I've just kind of gone... Oh, <laughs> you say, might be a little bit busy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Because how does your schedule look from now? I mean, I hope you've had a bit of a time to celebrate, but what, what happens from now on? Do you know? We, well, I think we're just we're busy today and then I think we're getting a few more news on what we're doing later throughout the week, but... I've, we don't know, we're just we get shifted into taxis and yeah. they're told yeah. where to go. Sort we of just thing. do what we're told. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we're, just, we're living in the moment at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. It's a whirlwind. Moment. But with regards yeah. to the future, I hear that Simon Cowell's record label has asked you to come on board. Is that confirmed or is that just...? It's, just... it's nothing's been confirmed yet. We're still kind of um, revelling in Saturday night's <laughs> like win, I think. But for now, we're just living in a whirlwind. Nothing's been confirmed yet, but hopefully there will be talks. Um, we'd love a record deal. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Funnily enough, yeah. 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 And what about the prize money? Because it's £250,000. Uh, Thomas, I hear that you're going to spend it on a tumble dryer. Is this right? <laughs> yes, it's the, it's the, the first thing I really, really want to get. I know it's not very exciting, but I'm a practical kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs>